Red Hat and Intel have been working together for the last several months, really putting together a reference architecture to help customers get better control over their sprawling data infrastructure today. We're able to take the building blocks for the cloud and be able to put those together with Red Hat storage to deliver a new scalable storage platform that uh, people can leverage for their growing inform information needs. What we see really happening around software-defined infrastructure and software-defined storage is really as we think about the evolution of software-defined infrastructure, it's really been built out initially around virtualization technologies. And what people were looking to get, the value they're getting out of the virtualization technologies, which is optimizations around overall compute infrastructure, uh, they're looking for that same type of capability across the infrastructure set of the data center. So today, you know, they've been able to get huge value around virtualization, but storage has very much stood in the way of getting greater value. So what we've done is we've taken the approach uh, very much like virtualization we've taken with Red Hat uh, storage to provide an open source uh, software defined storage platform that can use the infrastructure building blocks of today's data centers to build out widely scalable, highly performant storage solutions. One of the key drivers around this growth around storage and data is really across a number of different vectors. One being big data. That's one of the key areas people are talking about today. Really the idea behind that is harnessing the data being generated within your data center to make better business decisions. And to do that, that's driving organizations to come up with strategies to be able to harness more data and keep it online more of the time. Once it's online, they're now able to analyze that data and make it part of their new business decisions. And to do that, they need a new storage infrastructure. Uh, the old uh, vertically integrated storage infrastructures are hitting the wall when it comes to scaling out to meet the needs of today's petabyte scale data. So they're turning to software-based, software-defined storage as a solution for that to get the same kind of value they got out of virtualization infrastructure, optimization around the compute layer, now they're getting optimization around their data management infrastructure. Red Hat's overall vision for this area for software-defined or software-based storage is really to give people control and give IT choice around the infrastructure they need to deploy, leveraging the community innovation that comes with open source technology and break those traditional lock-in that traditional providers deliver. So if you're looking at traditional storage solutions, many companies are having to put uh, hundreds and thousands of dollars in migration of data alone. Today, when you start to looking at software-defined solutions, it starts to break that, that lock-in, al allowing you to make data more available to eliminate some of those migration costs. Not only do, from that perspective, we see today's data centers becoming more open, more hybrid in nature, which means customers are deploying solutions that need to be able to run on-premise, they need to be able to take advantage of virtualized resources, and they need to be able to support the public cloud. Today, storage solutions are locked into your data center. It's hard to take a physical box and put it in the cloud. Today, software-defined solutions allow you to create a platform that bridges all of that infrastructure, that unlocks that data so that you can use it when you need to use it, and gives you an overall platform that helps you reduce overall costs and is built on today's uh, data center building blocks, which is around Intel architectures and solutions. Intel adds dramatic value to the solutions because as you think, look at today's building blocks in data centers, it's all based on x86 architectures. Um, from that perspective, what we're doing with Red Hat Storage is we're leveraging that underlying infrastructure and those uh, resources and technologies to deliver more scalable, higher performance storage solutions that meet different customers' needs all with the same platform. And that wouldn't be possible without our partnership today.